So the kids came in, it's a bit of a dreary March morning, they were quite quiet, quite subdued and they've left. They're so lively, they're so enthusiastic, they've been absolutely raving. Um, the noise levels in here have been brilliant. From kids playing maths games but they're competitive against themselves, um, against other people all around the world and it's just, it's a fantastic event and they've loved it. Official patron of World Maths Day, Rachel Riley. I'm proud to be the patron of World Maths Day. Um, it's an event I've been involved with for quite a few years now and I've seen it grow. Um, the first time I came I thought they're locking kids in a room making them play maths games on a computer. Who's going to enjoy this? And I saw them and their faces and the enthusiasm, it was, it was just a pleasure to see. And the event's just grown and grown over the years and this year about 5.8 million kids around the world playing World Maths Day. It's really established and the, the new sets of children coming through are loving it just as much as the previous ones. Or we can pull that. I mean, World Maths Day shows that maths is a global language. It's something that's so important and it's instilled in kids from such a young age that it's an important thing, but sometimes kids can find it difficult um, and they struggle. But today, especially World Maths Day, events like this are about making maths fun. Um, and it's about just getting the kids at their level, whatever level they are, um, just playing and just improving in the, at their own pace. Um, and just something they do at home anyway, can play, playing computer games, um, but incorporating a bit of education, a bit of math into it, and it just becomes a game, um, and the kids just respond brilliantly. When I applied for my job on Countdown, I was pretty slow at mental arithmetic because I hadn't used numbers for years studying math at university. It was all equations and algebra and all sorts. Um, but it's all about training your brain. So practicing the Countdown numbers game and then practicing these games today, it just is about getting you, your brain in the right frame of mind. And you do get quicker the more you practice. It's just like anything. The more you train, the better you get. And the kids have seen that today as well.